Hello friends from Eobaro Forest in Lake District. I'm just hiking uh, up the hill. <laughs> no idea what is the name of it. And jumping above the fences, uh, jumping above little streams. Uh, just, just going to find a space where I can set up my camp because I'm gonna sleep uh, I'm gonna sleep in my tent tonight oh let me keep going because it's getting dark and I even don't have a place and I don't know where I'm going hopefully you are able to see it the sunset oh so beautiful that's mean my tent should look the opposite way Oh, so I will enjoy the sunrise. Oh, finally, I get a little bit out of the forest. So I'll have some uh, daylight as much as it possible. And keep... Up, keep going. Ooh. When I get out of the forest, it become windy straight away. I can, and now I should keep going. I should keep going, keep going. Finally, I set up my tent, uh, not the best spot, but it's not the worst as well. Hopefully, if the clouds get away, I'll have amazing view on the moon. It, it was amazing, full moon, it's so beautiful. At the moment, it's, it's just hiding. I set up the tent, I think this is one of the paths in this wood, so looks like it's path. <laughs> So, I am exactly on the path. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't think somebody will walk here in this time, but uh, early in the morning, maybe four, I will make it sure, four or five. I will make it sure I am awake. First of all, for the bottom of my sleeping place, I'm using this foam mat, isolating foam mat, I don't know what is the name of it but yeah this is my 
first layer, if I can say it this way, just at the bottom. Up! It keeps me very, very warm and very cozy. After that, I have this OEX Traverse, Extraverse, uh, just self inflatable mat. Nothing special, nothing fancy, uh, but it's, it's doing the job, you know. And my sleeping bag is not for the winter, it's not four seasons. And but this is not gonna stop me to camp. So I'm gonna use Van Gogh Night Star 250. As you can see, it's two, three season sleeping bag. Comfort zone is three degrees, transition is minus two, which is the limit. And the extreme it's minus 19, but nobody wants to get to the extreme zone. It's quite heavy, it's quite bulky, one kilo is, and 650 grams. Uh, it's yeah, it's quite quite heavy and bulky, but it's okay. Uh, I cannot complain. I bought it from Carboot, two of these, two the same, one blue and one green, for 10 pounds, which then they were brand new. It, I cannot complain. And. Um, I have my thermal pants and thermal blouse to sleep in and now I have something something extra. This is it. Cotton sleeping bag liner. I'm just gonna use it for inside. It's gonna give me extra heat, extra isolating. I just bought one of this fancy, nice, colorful uh, water bottle which I'm gonna fill up with hot water before I go to, go to bed. It's gonna keep me warm for sure. And uh, I have some hand warmers if it gets extremely cold to just put them into my sleeping bag. They're gonna give me like, as well extra heat. Um, I'm sure I'm not gonna be cold tonight. So. This is what I will have today for my dinner. <laughs> Quinoa, pumpkin, and sunflower seeds with wool grain basmati rice. Uh, looks nice. Hmm, it's very nice, very nice, but there is one problem, as usual, not enough salt. <laughs> the time is five past one and the rain is hitting with very strong winds it just woke me up oh. i like to listening to rain but not that strong so yeah this is it camping in the rain <laughs> The rain stops, I think this is the right moment to pack everything and just get away from here. I'm ready, my backpack, this is my my lovely, lovely camping spot. As you can see, no trace left, only this big photo. <laughs> uh, yeah, I was feeling from from the floor that below me it's soaking wet but soaking wet but the tent it's strong enough it's amazing tent i haven't got any water i was warm cozy in the entire night it was amazing very good
let's go come with me ah lovely easy walk with beautiful views and marking poles everywhere ah you cannot get lost lovely woodland amazing ah I'm keep walking, I don't know where I'm going. I'm just keep following the path. And I'm going to the car, get ready and I'll hit the mountains, not the hills. I need mountains, I need to get tired. Uh, I have one question for you guys. Uh, now, uh, in Go Outdoors, they have a... 20% uh, discount on some products so OE, OEX, High Gear and other few brands I don't know all of them but I stopped uh, on, on um, OEX Fox 1 one person tent I, I'm not sure it's a dome tent I, I, I don't know the, no it's not dome it's like wall, wall profile tent uh, just a single person, one per up, 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 very, very slippery. One person turned, uh, but it's very lightweight. Uh, for bad weather, I don't think it's the best option because in the bad weather you wanna, you cannot spend much time outside, uh, and you need to have a, your space inside the tent. So, I don't think it's good for bad weather. But I really liked it for good weather, and it's uh, um, and it's very lightweight. This is the the main thing. When I do long trips around UK and I hope outside of UK, uh, I really want to have something lighter. I'm very happy with my tent. Don't take me wrong. Um, I'm owning a Nature Hike Quad Peak too. I'm very happy with this tent. Have a look at the view but I really need something lightweight so if you guys uh, have experience with it you, you have it at home, you test it, you try it please let me know in the comments below what is your opinion So this is pretty much everything from my camp up in Ibaru Forest, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. 
I uh, just want to remind you that I'm gonna upload the second video from the second day of my adventure in Lake District tomorrow. So yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna upload the video because it was too long. So don't miss out. Check it. Have a look. I'm sure you're gonna enjoy it. I'm sure you're gonna love it because it's full with different weather conditions, amazing views, a lot of adrenaline. It's it's just nice video. So see you tomorrow. Stay safe and stay handsome. Thanks for watching.